NATO approves plan to expand support for Ukraine after lifting orb, ends veto. Media. Here's a summary of the article. Your profile can be used to present content that appears more relevant based on your possible interests, such as by adapting the order in which content is shown to you, so that it is even easier for you to find content that matches your interests. Content presented to you on this service can be based on your content personalization profiles, which can reflect your activity on this or other services, possible interests and personal aspects. Information regarding which content is presented to you and how you interact with it can be used to determine whether the content e.g. reached its intended audience and matched your interests. Reports can be generated based on the combination of data sets regarding your interactions and those of other users with advertising or content to identify common characteristics. Information about your activity on this service, such as your interaction with ads or content, can be very helpful to improve products and services and to build new products and services based on user interactions, the type of audience, etc. Content presented to you on this service can be based on limited data, such as the website or app you are using, your known precise location, your device type, or which content you are interacting with. Certain information is used to ensure the technical compatibility of the content or advertising and to facilitate the transmission of the content or add to your device. This post received a score of 6,300, with an upvote ratio of 97%. Here are the top comments in response to this article. Finally I hear good news that Orban can no longer impede aid to Ukraine. That guy has been nothing but a trouble for NATO. Seriously, NATO need to revise their bylaw so that one single member dissent can no longer put a stop to an agenda that most other NATO members agree on. Same with the EU. Edit. Remember that he blocked the 50B euro aid package. Veto. Acker giving the power to one single person to ruin everything for everyone else. Sounds like little Tommy Tuberville should take notice. Fuck that dumbass piece of shit. He's a fascist turd burger. I guess if I was Orban's owner I might be beginning to wonder what the point of him was now that NATO is working around him. No serious person thinks Hungary can prevent EU and NATO actions. That means Orban's role is not to prevent but to delay. Putin is quite happy with Orban because Orban was never meant to stop anything. Delay, obfuscate, complicate, that's his role, nothing more. And in the meanwhile, many precious lives are destroyed. His delay tactics have consequences on real lives. That should be unacceptable in a civilized society. We should really be bringing back the term desk murderers, because that is what he is. Fuck Auburn, piece of shit. That look on Auburn's face screams, I'm the evil, soulless prick people think I am. Kinda like Trump. Auburn, another Putin puppet. Trump is Putin's biggest prize not because he is smart or anything like that it's because Trump is willing to destroy the US. Feels odd seeing all those headlines on Pravda. Is Pravda no longer a Russian news service? This is Ukrainian Pravda different paper. Now that I actually think about it, Pravda was a Soviet news service, so it makes sense that a former republic of the USSR might have its own version. Thanks. Yes, yeah, similar in the English-speaking world, many countries have news outlets with similar names or path thereof, The Times, Telegraph, Daily, Tribune, Bulletin, Chronicle, Morning Herald, etc. etc. Poor Putin. His puppet is no longer useful. It's still in NATO's interest to keep Hungary as a member for logistical reasons. Switzerland and Austria are both neutral so the route to the Balkans and Black Sea areas would have to go south of the Alps otherwise. Having said that, I'm not sure exactly what kind of military transports they allow at the moment. If Auburn is compromised then he's going to block passage when the time comes. I think the reasoning is that Auburn will hopefully be gone by that time. Anyway, Hungary has been cut off from sensitive NATO intelligence and is now also politically isolated so things seem to be under control. The next step would probably be to exclude Hungary from all NATO planning. This video was automatically created by Reddit to speech. The article and comments in this video were selected from Reddit according to their upvotes, and any paraphrasing was performed by smmry.com, without any human intervention.